Have you heard the saying that rules are meant to be broken? Where there's one rule in marketing that won't change and will continue to work. And if you break it, you won't do well. Hey everyone, I'm Neil Patel, and today I'm gonna break down the only rule in marketing that you have to follow. Before we get started, make sure you subscribe to this channel. That way when I release more marketing advice like this, you'll get notified. Question for you. What do you think this rule is? Take a guess, leave a comment below. Well, the rule is the rule of seven. It's the rule that you cannot break. If you think about marketing, it's changed over time. You used to be able to build a business from just one channel. If you look at Facebook, they grew by sending you emails being like, your friend invited you to Facebook. If you look at Dropbox, they leveraged social media. Share this on Twitter to get more free space. If you look at a lot of other companies, they grew through one channel, like let's just say Google AdWords or SEO, but you can no longer grow through one company. The other thing that you'll find is, even if you find a few channels that are working out, you have so many competitors these days that just hitting people once won't cause enough conversions. From all the data that we've looked up at content marketing, social media marketing, even AdWords, people need to see your brand roughly seven times, technically I'm holding up eight fingers, but seven times before they end up converting into a customer. So once they see you seven times interact with your brand, they're much more likely to convert. Now let's break down how you can leverage the rule of seven. One, be on the social web. When you're on the social web and people have comments, questions, you can be there to answer and interact with them. That's a great way, not just posting content on these social sites, but also interacting, taking the time to respond to comments, helping them out, responding to the messages. That's the first thing you need to do. The second thing you need to do is leverage SEO. By being visible in the search engines, more people are gonna see you, they're gonna see your company, they're gonna see your brand, you're gonna do better. And you can do things like content marketing, you can do things like social media marketing, link building, interlinking, they all help. But SEO is very valuable. Google is the most popular site in the world. If you're not there, you're not gonna get as many eyeballs. The third thing I want you to do is leverage paid ads. Not just on Google, but also Facebook, Taboola, Outbrain, banner ads, media buys, any form of ads. You can go over to Facebook and click on info and ads. So you're going on Facebook to any of your competitors' fan page, click on info and ads, and you can see the ads they're running. This will give you a head start. You can also use tools like Uber Suggest to see where your competitors are getting traffic from. This will help you also get a head start. The fourth thing I want you to do is update your content. You already know content marketing is effective. You're writing content, but what very few people are doing is updating their content. You'll find that if you just write content and stop writing it, eventually your rankings will keep dwindling down and down. Why? Because there's roughly a billion blogs. That's one blog for every seven people. There's so much content Google wants to rank the fresh stuff. If you don't keep your content up to date, you won't continually rank and people won't keep seeing you. The last thing I want you to do is keep sharing your content. You know you're already on these social sites. People are already seeing your stuff when you post it, but not everyone does. Their algorithms are so restrictive, it's very rare that even 10, 20% of your audience is gonna see whatever you post. So might as well share that same piece of content three, four, or five times over a course of a year. It'll help you get more juice from that same piece of content. In essence, you're continually sharing, you're continually repurposing it. That'll help get you more eyeballs, more people back. And as a bonus tip, use tools like Hello Bar and subscribers to keep getting people back to your site. Because once they land there through push notifications and emails, you can get people to come back to your site, which will cause you in the long run to get people in touch with your site seven times, in touch with your brand seven times, to engage with your brand seven times, to engage with you seven times, and hopefully buy your product or service. If you need help growing your marketing, your traffic, your sales, check out my ad agency, Neil Patel Digital. If you enjoyed the video, like it, share it, leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.